hi everyone so i hope who are preparing for gate they are doing fine now uh, this is the last video before the gate exam so i am uploading now so we have seen or i am uploading the from the last few days only formulas or pdfs in like a form of video so there is a reason why i am doing that now when we do revision the revision notes should be it should be short like maybe 10 pages or maybe maximum 20 pages right this 10 pages or 20 pages should cover all concepts and the formulas which are in the concepts because from past you now uh, six months or three months four months everyone is preparing so they have done uh, almost the so many problems regarding some concepts right but at the final stages we have only required the revision notes right it's not like we have to revise all the concepts so like 100 pages notes or 200 pages notes no it is not required actually because we already know some concept but we have to revise quickly those concepts in time of formulas right now why i uploaded those formulas only so it is it should be follow like this if you keep on reading you may forget after some time right it may be one day it may be two days but when you see something or any formula you remember so much many so many days it may be one month it may be two months this one is if we do anything we can understand that concept so it is regarding the concepts wise the when we do study so when we do a concept based problem suppose you learn some superposition theorem in network theory so unless until you do one problem or two problems on that concept then only we will understand that concept once we understand we never forget that concept in our life right so for these two reasons so this is the main reason why i am uploading only the formulas so maybe important formulas or it is covering all maybe all topics the why before two weeks is we have to see regularly maybe so this is a 10 minutes video or 5 minutes video just we just download the video just when you are you bored just see the formulas that's it because this one we are already doing from the past 4 months 3 months 6 months so we are doing the problems on these different different concepts so you understand understand already so but the final stage is we have to see the formulas right you know keep uh, regularly so that's why i am uploading those videos so so maybe somewhat some fellows got some you know when you are finding some hardness in the videos but i hope i cover some form maybe all formulas in the basic concepts or basic uh, subjects right so that is my main aim to when you see you may be remember at least one month so our exam will be over so we may, we may score more marks or if you see only those formula also we will get so many marks in the each subject right the final one is the gate exam day strategy so what is this strategy strategy is so it is not like unique you have to follow this only but when you find this strategy is somewhat better so you can follow that strategy because we have discussed so many i mean uh, the experts so we have discussed like this so we are having 180 minutes time that is three hours so we, we have to solve 65 questions now in general aptitude on english so we we have to allot 15 minutes only there is a reason why because it will contain one more questions five so five five questions five minutes some question may take only 50 seconds 30 seconds 10 seconds also we can solve right but for two mark questions we have to apply i mean into two to two minutes for each question so we may solve in one minute also sometimes so we have to read some bar sheet bar questions so suppose some question is given like this so some uh, uh, 2002 2015 some information is given so we have to find some average etc so it may take some maximum two minutes so within 15 minutes we have to complete the general aptitude or an english one right we you, you can uh, allot these 15 minutes at the end or at the stop beginning also so that is our wish right so but don't go beyond 15 minutes for the this general aptitude in english 
sometimes one question may going for 5 minutes sometimes because it happens to me also but when we are wasting this 5 minutes here so we may lose this technical questions why right? because we so much concepts we learn so we can apply those minutes here so we can solve more problems so maximum is 15 minutes for the general aptitude and english now for the when it comes to technical so in technical one more questions will be there which are 25 now again it is 25 into 2 minutes so 50 minutes is for 25 i mean one more questions maximum is 15 minutes 50 minutes so we should not give more than the 15 minutes suppose one question is going beyond 2 minutes or 3 minutes maybe 4 minutes that means our we are applying the wrong concept when it is beyond 2 minutes means so we have to alert because it is taking time so we may lose marks in the next questions it may be very simple you may get in one minute only so that is a strategy for this one more questions in technical right so don't go beyond two minutes or three minutes that means one time you didn't get the answer another time you didn't get the answer just leave that question that's it so go for the next one when the time left and the last then we can come back that questions if you know that concept right don't assume it may be right right the probability of that wrong is 95 percent will be there when you're assuming or when you are guessing right so the probability of getting wrong is 95 percent or 99 percent only one percent chance for the right so that is by your luck so don't assume the answers so remember that point now 50 plus 15 we have allotted the 65 minutes for this technical one mark questions on the the general aptitude in English. The remaining 115 minutes for two marks questions. There is a reason why. Because if you do a 20 questions from this, so we will get 40 marks in this two, uh, two marks questions only. That means when you are allotting 115 minutes, at least the minimum time or maximum time we can allot for each question is 3.8 minutes. Sometimes the two marks questions also we will get we may solve in one minute we may solve in two minutes so when you are solving quickly for the uh, which you know very well the remaining questions you may get five minutes also for each questions so when you are allotting more time on two, two marks questions we there is a probability that scoring high i mean maximum marks in the gate exam right now Sometimes, so this has happened to me. I started the general aptitude English in the previous 2016. Now, I allotted approximately 30 to 40 minutes here only. So, I got one stuck at one question that is clock, clock question. So, I wasted so much time here. And similarly, I solved this uh, one more questions approximately 21 to 22 questions, right? But when it comes to two marks questions, I left behind only, I mean, I left one hour time only. In this one hour, I just, I have to, I mean, solve 30 questions, but I just solved 30 questions, but I just solved 11 questions only. That is the main drawback I got. So, I got 35.88 marks, right? So in this 11 only 11 questions I may got the only 8 questions right then remaining are so it's only dash so I got didn't get the negative marks so 35.88 marks I got so the all India rank was 6175 right this is the marks I got in 2016 that's why my friends I'm telling if you start with the technical questions 2 marks and you are allotting maximum is again 115 you have to in, keep in mind that maybe maximum 120 minutes you may spend the two marks questions and at least if, if we solve the 20 questions from this only i will get 40 marks then remaining one hour or the 60 minutes if you spend this 25 questions you can solve easily if you know or if you did so much uh, hard work you can solve easily 20 to 22 questions so if even it is 20 questions are right we will get 20 marks in this so 60 sorry 40 plus 20 you will get 60 marks 
now that is in our hand how much you practice for general aptitude and english so sometimes without practice also from the english we may solve so if you are scoring this is uh, going for the average at least this 15 marks so if you are scoring at least 5 to 7 marks or 8 marks so i will we will get approximately 60 5 to 68 marks right so when you go by this strategy see this strategy is only for you followed the videos or you are following some strategy right to get the good rank that is less than 1000 or less than 500 when you are aiming for less than 100 right so the strategy is approximately you can follow this but we have to score more on two marks questions at least 25 to 30 that is maximum we can go but so that is depends on our how much we did uh, the concepts wise or problems wise how many problems you solved right how much practice you did that is depends on the the questions two marks questions similarly one more questions and general aptitude right so you just follow this strategy and see the results in the simply mock it you take just one mock it before the exam or before so so many days are there approximately one week so you can practice by this strategy now see what is the results you are getting if you are getting good results just follow this one all right so my best wishes for all the students who are preparing for gate so in 2017 you get a good rank right so all the best everyone